Hey YouTube, this is just a quick how-to video to set up your USB thumb drive with music for your Subaru Starlink system. This is more for the people who have the 6.2 inch screen. I used to have that version of the radio in my STI and Subaru helped me out and upgraded me to the 7 inch navigation unit which actually works really well with iPods. But those of us who had the 6.2 inch know that it does not work well at all with an iPod. It takes forever to connect to it, even though it is connected. And every time you restart your car, it resets to your alphabetical list. It doesn't pick up playing where you left off. So one band-aid is to actually use its USB thumb drive and put your music on it. So I wanted to show how to do that. So this is my thumb drive here with my music. I just bought a 32 gigabyte one. And when I open it up, I already have my music on it from when I had the older screen. But you can see that I have all my music in separate folders. Now you'll notice that there's band folders for different albums, even though it's the same band. So for example, Sonic Youth, I have one, two albums from them. But they're different, and I didn't want to mix all the tracks from them together. So it, when you use it in your car, it actually looks like an iPod, the way everything's in alphabetical order and listed. And it's by, it'll be listed uh, by band and album when you open it up on your actually 6.2 screen. So it's pretty nice. So here's, for example, Sonic Youth's um, washing machine album. You open it up. I just liked the one song off of it. But I like having my stuff organized. So when you open up that album, you'll see there's just the one song. If I go back, here's Sonic Youth's other album. And I actually liked the whole album. So you'll actually see all the tracks from that album listed. And I have another one listed. It, I think I had three of their albums. Oh yeah, here's the other one. Um, Goo. Um, for whatever reason, it's not next to that one. But when you load it up in your car, they will be all in order, alphabetized. But anyway, here's Sonic Youth's other album, and you can see all the tracks from there. So if I'm in my car and I want to listen to Sonic Youth, these three albums will actually pop up in separate folders, which is kind of nice. So it's similar to an iPod. Um, your music is very organized in alphabetical order, and it's also organized by album. There's really nothing else you can do with that 6.2-inch Starlink system from Subaru. It just doesn't play well with iPods for whatever reasons, new or old. So anyone who's interested in making folders with their music, um, this is how you would do it. Uh, I just listed all my bands separately and I separated the bands with different folders for each album. So like for example if you look here Nirvana, I have a ton of albums from Nirvana. Some of these are live bootlegs and things like that. But you can see like when Nirvana would pop up on my screen, I would have a choice of all these albums to listen to. So all the tracks aren't like put together in one big folder. It was like, oh, where's this album or where's this album? So it's a very easy way to organize your music. And unfortunately, I can't load this in the car or it's I don't feel like walking downstairs to do it. But trust me when I tell you, if you organize your music in folders with by band and album, multiple albums from each band it will set up just like an iPod and it's the best fix you can really do if you want to use your iPod music in your Subaru Starlink 6.2 inch the nice thing is it picks up where it left off with the USB stick it loads quicker than iPod does anyway it finds the music a lot quicker so until Subaru decides to fix the firmware on the 6.2 inch Starlink this is probably your best option I wouldn't even bother with an iPod at that point because who wants to keep going to their playlist or whatever it resets every time you restart your car at least with the USB stick it will continue playing wherever it left off like it should with the iPod um, but you're just using it via USB stick so hopefully this was helpful to anyone who wants to set up their music it is very simple um, I have a 32 gigabyte and it found all my files fine I don't know if Subaru has a restriction on size or folders or anything like that, but this is over, this is almost 16 gigs worth of music, and I didn't have any issues with it. So if you have any questions, please leave a comment. If you like it, please subscribe and thumbs up. Thank you for watching.